I wanna take a minute and talk about how PathPilot manages tools. So in this scenario, we've got no tool in the spindle, but the next tool up is already loaded in the tool changer. So when I hit cycle start, PathPilot's gonna grab the tool it needs. In this example, there's no tool changer installed. Therefore, PathPilot is gonna prompt the operator for every tool it needs. At that point, the machine will go to G30 and prompt the operator to replace the tool with the next tool in line. And in this last example, most of the tools are in the tool changer, but it needs a tool that's not. So it's gonna put away the current tool and then prompt me for that tool 40 that it needs. So, and then a quick cycle start gets it running again. And since I manually loaded this tool in the spindle, PathPilot's gonna want me to unload that tool before it can continue on with the job. Therefore, once it's done, it goes to G30 and holds, tells the operator to remove the tool. Once you do, a cycle start will continue the process again.